Hey guys, it's Lydia. So, um, I look crazy and it's been a while. Um, it's literally been since like December that I uploaded the video, but that's a no, actually, maybe it was January. I think it was January, but so like a lot went down, like got crazy, school got crazy, but like we're back now and that's what matters. But so I know that like one of the last videos I uploaded was me dyeing my hair black. But today we're gonna try and bleach it. Um, I didn't film it, but yesterday I did. I tried to use Oops Color Remover. I don't know if you can see, but like it kind of looks brown on top. A little bit. Um, it didn't really work in my opinion. Can I leave it up there? Does that work? Oh, that's a mess. But then I did two strand tests to see if my hair would lighten at all. There's this. And then I did another one here that lightened better because this side was lighter. There's like this. So that was when I left it on for 20 minutes um, once. So I think I'm going to do 40 minutes twice this time. I have all my stuff in a bag that I'm going to bring downstairs because I'm doing this again without telling my parents. Um, I was supposed to do it at my friend's house, but then we had to do it here instead. So we're just going to do it in my downstairs bathroom without telling my parents until the morning. But so yeah, we'll keep you guys updated. I don't even know if Amelia wants to be in a video, so maybe I just want to end up filming, filming this. But hopefully you guys see this because I'm trying to make a comeback once like APs are done and stuff. Uh, but yeah. Wait, this is the first time I've ever featured. Should I introduce myself? Hey guys, I'm Amelia. Oh. <laughs> okay guys, this oh, is Amelia. Right? Yeah. We're Hi. about to bleach my hair. Um, I did the intro, so you already know about like this little thing and what I did. You did the intro already? Yeah, I did the intro already. Wait, can I introduce myself? Yeah. <clears throat> hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Um, it's Amelia. I'm kidding. You might get us confused because, you know, we kind of look alike. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm kind of boring. I'm Amelia. I'm a junior and I'm Olivia is my best friend. I should mention it was like 11.15 or 11.30 when we started doing this, so that's my excuse for our behavior. Enjoy. <laughs> okay, so guys, this is my bleach. Oh, I think I have scooped a thing. Okay. Hi, Olivia. I love you. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> Anyways, um, I am a dancer. <laughs> and that's like my only personality trait. Oh, I'm tall. That's my other personality trait. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna... okay. Wait, can I sew? Oh, that's kind of ugly. One to two. So we'll do. Two of these, four of those, and then some of the old ones. Which is What's the old one? Uh, oh, that's it's in the okay, it's the thing that the professional people use to get oh, Okay, now we're taking the thirty volume developer because my hair is still dyed black. Yay! No, guys, I did AP Spanish. Okay. <laughs> she speaks French. Okay, let's stir this first, and then I'll figure out. <laughs> I'm a fan. I feel like this still isn't the right consistency, but like it's definitely the answer is definitely not putting in more developer. Yeah. Like if anything, it's like too much. Okay, guys. So um, we're gonna put some old flex into my bleach mixture. I can't really tilt it towards you guys, but it's there and it's blue and it's chunky. <laughs> so chunky. I think we do one sixteen or a little more. That's what it said. I'm just trying. 
<gasps> I'm wearing my dare t-shirt. Okay, I think we're gonna do it. So I'm so gonna start with the bottom of my head and move up. I'm not doing my roots yet because your roots process faster than anything else. Um, so you always do your roots last. She did her research. Uh, he, okay, I've been watching videos of people doing their hair at home since I was like 12. So like it's Good. about time I did it myself. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna do the foil method because heat makes it process oh, faster. Oh. It means I'm gonna go like this. This powder is and like put a piece of foil here. Yeah. And then I'm gonna You're gonna do it. You can't really see what you're doing. I know, so you're gonna hold that there. Yeah. Um and I'm gonna, I'm gonna go in. Do it. Unless you wanna do, do it. Is. You, gotta, you gotta do it. Oh. Oh wait, I have gloves. It works. Okay. okay. When we go to dance competitions, we always see the studio who has like, they do like a French braid into like a bun and then like more buns down their head and that's what you look like. Wait, is it just me or is it already? I think it's just me. I was gonna say it's you, and I think it's placebo. Yeah. Weird. Or it's like the color of the bleach on top of the color of my hair. It just looks like that. Mm -hmm. No. That's not no, just me. That's not just you. Oh. Is it supposed to do that? That smells so bad. Oh I'm like choking, bro. <laughs> Good. I can't smell anything. It's just like right next to my head. Oh god. Um, I'm also really sensitive to fumes and I used to throw oh, up it. I used to throw up like when the nail polish fumes were too strong. So it's not really the best quality. I'm like up. congested and I can smell it. Yeah, it's just like bones. Me too. So viewers, the reason why I'm doing this is because I do impulsive things with my hair when I'm stressed. It's because she's a Leo. <laughs> Just Leo things. Guys, everybody comment down below your um, sign. Your sun sign, your rising sign, your moon sign. I'm a Virgo, but I don't know my other signs. And I think Olivia has a screen. You're a Pisces it. moon. I remember that. I don't know what these things mean. But I forget what your rising sign is. Because I remember we looked up your we looked up your sign and then we forgot to look at your rising sign. watched a lot of videos, especially in the past few days of people doing this. Um, they were all using like different bleach than I was. I've never seen anyone use this bleach. And why is that? Um, I don't know, but so I got all this stuff from Sally's. Uh, the <laughs> first place, the first bleach I got was uh, like from Wella, which is like a good hair brand. They're the brand that has like the toner I'm using. But um, I got it and I realized it was white bleach, which is like fine, like it does the job, but this will help tone while it bleaches. Okay, everybody, this is a tour. This is what's in my Olivia. <laughs> what's in my Olivia? <laughs> She's got the horses in the back. <laughs> okay. She has some tin foil and she's got some bleach and a bun. Love. And there's that. the mirror and that's me and you. Yeah, so we ran out of bleach, so we're making, we're making some more. more. Can I flip this to be this way? Oh! <gasps> 
it's so difficult. Oh, my neck. My back. There's no <laughs> back, right? So what inspired you to become a YouTuber? Um, was it Lord DIY? It was not Lord DIY. However, I did meet Lord DIY, you guys. You no way. Oh, wondering. I'm like breaking your camera. I'm going to insert the picture here. Right over Amelia's face. Right here. That's the other thing, my mom's away for the weekend. Yeah, she's, she's gonna she My would've, mom would murder me. She would have been so sus. Like I was able, I eventually like I completely forgot to wear my hood around my dad and he just like didn't say anything. Good. Like literally had like bright red streaks in my hair <laughs> from where I bleached it. Did he notice? He didn't say anything. I don't know if he noticed, but he definitely didn't say anything. What do you think he would have said something? I think he would have because he would have like I don't like your hair to kill me. without the bleach looks kind of like a red panda. Thank you. Oh yeah, it's a really good combo. <laughs> oh my god, I would have two. Wait, feel how hot this is. It's so oh, like right here. Yeah. Because then it's like on my neck, but like it's fine. Like it's not that bad. I just like, I was like, oh, is that like bleach on my neck? But then I was like, no, it's the heat of my hair. Your hair is I take it out and it all falls out. Yeah. Not gonna work. fail. Bleach hair fail video. Okay, hey guys. So something real quick that didn't get caught on camera apparently, sorry I'm just trying to hide my hair, is that um, those foils in the back of my head that I said were getting hot actually started steaming so I had to take them out, rinse out all the bleach, like even though the top bleach hadn't processed yet, I had to just like rinse it all out, wash my hair, um, because I literally thought my hair was going to fall off, it was really hot, so uh, that was interesting. But then I apparently did a whole second round of bleach without filming, and that's what you're looking at now. So, enjoy. Hey guys, so I did a second round of putting on bleach. It actually looks so, like this is actually gonna turn out well. Knock on wood. All right, this is just like more foreshadowing, so calm down. Okay, okay, but foreshadowing. Okay, well it's like you know, a, It's gonna be good. This is a red flag. Or maybe not. I think it's gonna look good. I hope it's gonna look good. It like just hit me that I'm actually gonna be blonde. So the one, the bleach I'm putting on right now is um, mixed with 10 volume because I ran out of 30 volume, which is also good because I'm putting it on my end so it's gonna be like less harsh. But also it's, it's gonna 2:47 take in the morning. <laughs> or it's 2:47. <laughs> we have rehearsal at seven, eight. Oh my god. <laughs> Um, the fumes are really bad. My neck and my scalp are burning. Do you want me to, like, get that? No, it's okay. I'm sure. I just kind of got used to it. It's not good. It is what it is. But, uh, so I'm just finishing up, like, doing my roots and stuff, and I'm gonna put oil just on my, like, the top of my head to make sure my roots lift evenly and, like, fast enough because, like, these ones, you can't really tell. These ones are still really brown, but like up here, they're already like blonde. And we did these first, which is why I just like want to make sure that I want to make sure my baby hair's in the back. Okay, so after this, we still have to tone, which is gonna be so fun. Did I get what it? We're like Tana Mojo. I know bleach and tone. Bleach and tone. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm I look like George Washington. <laughs> Look like that. Write about that on your A push test. You're gonna post this in like two months. A push what? test is gonna be over. We're gonna have our <laughs> test scores on. It's gonna be obvious that I got like a three. I mean, you don't have to call me out like that, but okay, I guess. Okay, I'm just worried about my roots on this side. Do you see what I mean? Yeah. Like they're not lifting at all. Yeah. 
I'm gonna like go in and make sure I got them from both slides, I guess. So then I'm gonna let this chill out here. Oh, How long do you have to leave it on? I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave it on for 10 minutes with foil around my head. <gasps> okay, see you soon. Okay, hey guys, a little update. Um, I rinsed out the second bleach and it's really orange and dark still and I have the Wella T18 toner which is probably a mistake. I went for the lightest one. Probably shouldn't have done that. Probably should have been a little more like smart about that. But so I know you're not supposed to put bleach on wet hair but like some of this is still really dark and I really just want to like make sure that this works. Like I want to have hair that's like mildly light and long. Um, and so I still have to tone obviously but I'm letting the old flex number two stuff sit in right now. Um, I'm always watching friends, but while I do that, I'm gonna let this bleach go. I really like the really like, brown hair is here still, and like back here, like in my roots. So like, I'm really just trying to make sure that like. another piece of tin foil on it and maybe some heat but this is also like the lightest area mm, I'm a little stressed but I think I got a little overconfident in how good this was going to turn out we'll see we'll see there's always hope there's always hope you guys <laughs> we'll see how it goes I'll keep you updated so this is as good as it's gonna get. Now I'm gonna put on the Wella G18 toner mixed with 10 volume developer. I'm hoping it will help with the orange. I do think it's gonna be too light, but it's worth a shot. They said you could do it on damp hair. So that's what I'm gonna do. I really want it to work. Because I have rehearsal, as Amelia and I mentioned tomorrow morning. I'm not trying to look crazy and my mom's gonna kill me anyway and she would give me a little less if it looked good. So I'll check back in once it's on and hopefully it's working. Okay, so the toner's been in for at least 20 minutes. I don't like it looks not brassy, but it's also really dark. So I'm gonna wash it. If not, I have some more bleach. We're gonna figure it out. So I'm gonna wash my hair. This has been all over the place. I'll see you soon. Because Amelia is asleep, she hasn't been giving you some little planner updates. Oh, that's the other thing, Amelia is asleep. She like fell asleep for a second and then came and like, I just could have gotten out of the shower after toning because I took a full shower uh, after toning. And she's like, yeah, listen, like I just, I need to go to sleep because like, understandable. So now she's like, breakdown real quick but it's it's fine <laughs> so here's the deal my hair looks bad and it's not doing well it's like I walked out into the light and I saw a bunch of broken hairs everywhere and it's like doesn't feel good and all that stuff but like I feel sick to my stomach because I don't want to go outside like this I knew this was a risk I knew it was probably gonna turn out like this because like whatever and like I don't know why but like I got a glimmer of hope there for a second that it was gonna turn good and now it's not so I'm gonna, as terrible as an idea as it may seem, I'm gonna use some of this other white bleach that I had, blue bleach, um, with 10 volume. I'm gonna put foils on some of the parts that I think need them. My hair's still a little damp. I'm gonna like dry it, but 
yeah, I just can't go outside like this. Like, it just needs to be a little, at least, yellower and not, like... Okay, I've like that. Not, like, burnt orange. So, um... Yeah, that's where I'm at right now. I literally feel sick to my stomach and I'm just asleep, which of course makes sense because it's 5 o'clock in the morning, um, which is probably part of why I feel sick to my stomach. Like, I'm so tired and I have two hours to fix this mess. Um, so, yeah. Okay, so, um, still stressed. Going through a spot, spot bleaching it right now. Like looking for really dark parts. Of course, I can't see the back of my head, so there could be a lot of really dark parts on the back of my head. Um, and I'm gonna take out my phone camera and like try and access them as best as I can. But yeah, I just don't know how much more my hair can take. Hey there. So apparently, that was the last clip I filmed. When I was actually bleaching my hair like myself that night but so that was in May it is the end of July now so it's been about three months because that was the beginning of May um so because I never showed you the end result this is what my hair looked like more or less um after I finished it I think I ended up bleaching it three times that night I'm not sure how much of that got translated I as you could tell I was freaking out by the end so like wasn't necessarily remembering to record. Amelia was asleep. I was like alone and my hair was orange and I didn't know what to do. Um, but so I had to go to a salon in my town to get it fixed. Um, I actually had like my school dance performance two weeks after I bleached my hair. And so I went and I was hoping that it would be like this before that dance performance and it was not. Um, <laughs> they essentially couldn't see me until after that performance which was a little stressful so here's a picture of my hair being bright yellow however in between me bleaching it and me getting it fixed I did touch up a few spots in the back because there were some like jet black like not bleached at all spots so my sister helped me I touched up some like super orange parts but overall I just left it for um, professionals to help me with they went in and it took a few times to get it to kind of like the tone I wanted but this is what my hair looks like now. It's a little more warm toned than I was expecting but also like after going from jet black like going platinum and white was not like a realistic expectation. Um, I will say a lot of my hair did suffer like my ends are really damaged and I do straighten my hair because I have naturally curly hair so like not only did I bleach my hair a total of like six times, I think, because I also did some uh, like some bleach washes myself after getting it fixed because I still didn't like how it was and all this stuff. And um, <laughs> but and then I recently got my roots touched up. I'll insert a picture of what I looked like with roots here. My hair grows really fast, so within the two months between me getting my hair, me bleaching my hair and getting it touched up like last week, my roots were like out to here which means my hair grows fast, which is good, but also it means I have to spend more money keeping it up, which is not so good. Um, but so my ends are a bit damaged. I have breakage throughout all of my hair. Um, I've been trying to take really good care of it. I've been using like the, it's a 10 miracle hair mask, whatever. Every time I wash my hair, I only wash my hair once a week. I also been using the Olaplex number three before washing my hair. Um, I used castor oil the other day. I'm really just using anything that I think will help. Um, I'm also gonna cut my hair to like here again, just to like cut off these dead ends. Like I know my hair grows fast, like within two months, my hair grew this much. So like if I cut it to here and I decide I want it to here again, I literally, by October, my hair will be this length again. Like I'm not that concerned about it, but I just wanna give my hair a chance of being healthier. I just wanna cut off all the super damaged bits and just give it a new chance at life and you know like if my hair ever gets to a point where it's like super healthy and could withstand being bleached all over again you know like why not like i want to i would want to try going lighter if my hair could handle it because i'm not going to do anything that makes my hair fall out 
um i got when i did get my roots touched up because my hair grows so fast um there is some like yellow banding that isn't my favorite but it is what it is um i use purple shampoo a lot to keep my hair as not yellow as possible see this is what i'm saying even there like a hair just fell out like my hair is not terrific but it's also not like falling out and clumped it's a little gummy when it's like um wet you know like all those horror story videos you see where like people's hair is like ramen noodles my hair is kind of like that it's leaving that stage like it's been getting better recently but that is because i've been doing everything i can to take care of it i try and like use as little heat as possible so i've been trying to see which i like better either i'll blow dry it when i get out of the shower to try and not have to straighten it but that takes longer because because my hair is so damaged it retains a lot of water and it's really hard to dry or instead i'll um let it air dry what i do is i kind of like tuck these pieces behind my ears while it dries and then this kind of dries straight the ends are so damaged they dry straight anyway and then it's really just like the back in under here that i have to actually straighten um and of course i use heat protectant when i do that but yeah i just wanted to say like this is my hair i like it i like being blonde i think being black was easier um ooh, that part's not really straightened i literally just straightened my hair like two seconds ago because i washed it last night um i think being having black hair was more natural for me because i was like channeling my inner emo girl from when i was like 12 and i listened to 21 pilots on repeat um and it was so fun i loved having black hair but like i don't know having blonde hair is just a completely different experience i'm actually dyeing my hair pink next month because that's something i can do with blonde hair but i'm dyeing it pink with like a temporary color and it'll wash out in like six washes or whatever so i'm really excited to do that um yeah being blonde is fun it's hard work but it's fun yeah i also i know joanna sevilla or however you say her last name just uploaded a video like this um, like two days ago or something, but I do want to say I did this in May. I'm not trying to copy her. I'm not trying to hop on the bandwagon. Um, but yeah, also my parents were really mad when they found out because also my hair was orange. Like it's not like it turned out well and they were like, like we're mad, but like at least you don't look crazy. Like it was like we're mad and you look crazy and now we have to spend more money to fix it. So they made a deal that uh, I have to tell them about the things I do to my hair now. So um I, they know I'm dyeing my hair pink, so I can't use that as like a quick baby title anymore. But I just keep looking at my hair to make sure it's okay. Because that's the thing about filming like a video about my hair. Because I'm just like, does my hair look good? Does my hair look good? Um, it also does look yellower than this sometimes. This is obviously just really good lighting. Because I'm sitting right in front of a window. But yeah, tomorrow's also my birthday. So I also want to say, I know I haven't uploaded in a while. I'm not sure if I addressed this before the video or if this is it. But I know I haven't uploaded in a while. Um, I have a bunch of stuff filmed I just have to edit. So tomorrow is actually the one year anniversary of my first video on this channel. Um, Cause it also was my birthday. So it's been over a year since my hip surgery. So I have a video of me talking about that, which is a mess and I'm just rambling, but I'll upload it probably, hopefully tomorrow. Um, and then I vlogged some trips I went on and I'll vlog me cutting and dyeing my hair as that happens because I know that's the content everyone's here for. Um, but yeah, that's all for now. This is my hair. I'm blonde. Like I got my roots done a week ago and you can already see like the dark hair is growing in because my hair grows so fast. Um, but thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below. Um, don't do this at home. Dyeing your hair from black to platinum or whatever this is considered is not a good idea because your hair might fall out. Um, <laughs> but so, yeah, thank you so much for watching. This is not a tutorial. Don't sue me if you try this at home. Okay. Bye.